Hey YouTube, Blue Over the Wind here with another card box opening. This time we're doing the Pikachu V Union uh, Celebrations Special Collection. Now, this is a bit of a weird one, and some of you might already see why this is a weird one. Uh, it's supposed to come with four cards that become one big giant V Union card, and, uh, well, if you can see, and I'm hoping you guys can see this all right, uh, it looks like we may have gotten duplicated, scanned? I'm not, I'm not sure. So, uh, Nintendo or GameStop, if you're watching this, yes, it was like this before I opened it. Now, I will say, there seems like there's two cards behind on the bottom here, so I was tempted to return this, but I want to roll the dice. Maybe we'll be lucky. Maybe they'll be in there after all. It does say there's supposed to be a helpful supporter card featuring Professor Burnett, so I imagine that's got to be at least one of them, but maybe it's got the card that we're missing behind there as well. Uh, hopefully, if not, we still get the giant card, we still get the celebrations cards, and hopefully, fingers crossed, this ends up being worth opening, and I don't regret my decision as soon as this, as soon as I get through the box. Alright guys, so again, if you couldn't see it before, now you definitely can see it. One, two, looks good. Three should be over here, and this is obviously a duplicate of that card when it should be its own separate. It's a whole thing. Like I said, there's some cards behind it. My fingers are crossed that that's not going to be the end of the world. Maybe, I mean, I want to say that maybe they are multiple are like this, but no matter how much I look, I can't find anything or anyone talking about having the same problem. <laughs> Knowing my luck, this is probably a rare box that if I kept it like this for another year and a half, it's going to be worth $30,000. But I think that's unlikely. And uh, in the meantime, I really want to open it up. I really wanted these cards. And I was really excited when I found it at GameStop. So uh, a little disappointed when I realized the glitch. But hopefully, hopefully I don't regret this as we begin to open it. And it's too late now. They're not going to, no refunds. No refunds once it's open, guys. In tradition, we yeet the box behind us and we move forward with what we've got here. Now, let's start with the, the real big question I've had this whole time is what are these cards that are behind it? So let's find out. And uh, instantly, I can tell you guys, a little disappointment. It's definitely a glitch because one of them is, of course, the Professor Burnett card. The other one... It's just the code that comes with the Pokemon code that comes with it. So, it was definitely a glitched box, which kind of sucks. So let's just be real about it. It means that we're going to be shy our one card. So, that feels kind of like a, a bit of a, I don't want to say a scam, but I guess I should have, buyer beware. Uh, I could have returned it. I should have returned it, probably. But honestly, I was so curious about what's going to be in here that... I had to check it out. So there's our Professor Burnett card, guys. Then, of course, all four of these, which are going to be making up our Pikachu V Union, or at least a large part of our Pikachu V Union. I'm hoping maybe, uh, as they're all dropping everywhere, I hope that maybe I can figure out a way, somehow, to trade that one in, or, uh, or something of the sort. Because, yeah, I mean, well, that's that's practically right. That's almost correct. Forgot to grab sleeves at the beginning of this, but now I've got them. Now I've got the sleeves. Here we go. I'm going to still go ahead. I'm going to sleeve all these cards up. Hopefully, I figure out something to do with that. Maybe I can find someone to trade. Maybe, uh, maybe I'll just have to buy it separate. I'm not 100% sure, to be honest. Maybe it'll just be a really funny story for the future. Tell my grandkids one day. You want to know about one more mistake I made in life. <laughs> All right. Of course, then, uh, also in here, guys, we've got the giant supersized card. Which is going to be looking great. I wanted this big time. I want, I've been hanging them all up. All my large cards framing and hanging. And I, I can't wait to get that one up as well. So that'll be a... Uh, a soon-to-be-done job. Also, sleeve Professor Burnett, just in case. All right, so in this thing, we got our uh, two plus two more. That's our celebrations packs. We got our four celebrations packs ready to go. Looking forward to opening those. We also got a uh, Sword Shield Darkness Ablaze. 
as well as a Battle Styles pack. Plastic Alicia. Don't worry, I'm a trained Canadian. Let's start things off. I feel like, let's start with our Battle Styles. I feel like that probably has to be maybe my least favorite of the sets that I've got here. So let's start off here and let's see where we go from there. Opening up Battle Styles. There's the code. Let's see. One, two, three, four. We toss it over, we flip, and we've got Fighting Energy. Girder. Tower of Darkness. Perugly. Gligar. Honage. Scatterbug. Houndor. Frillish. Blitbug is our reverse hollow. And Octillery. Nice shiny Octillery for our rare. Darkness Ablaze being the next one, guys. The nice uh, big Charizard on the front there. Maybe a sign of good things to come. Maybe not. Let's find out together. And once again, Darkness Ablaze just gets thrown to the side. There. Pretend it's pretend I'm organizing this properly. Getting a phone call midway through this. Perfect. And let's go ahead and see what we've got. Our energy card. Vibrava. Dedene. Cute little card. Steeny. Marini. Melton. Carablast. We've got Sinisty. Toxel, Clink as our reverse holographic, very nice. And Hoopa, Hoopa, our rare holographic, cool card. All right, now to the meat and potatoes of what I love about this, guys. And that's, of course, our Celebrations Packs. Celebrations Packs, I am obsessed with this series. I love every single card, pretty much. Really excited to see what we've got in here. Let's, uh, without further ado, let's just jump right into them. I choose to believe that when I have a hard time opening a pack, that means it's good luck. All right, let's see what the first set, first set has to open. We're gonna go ahead and flip it over. We got a uh, holographic Lugia, not bad. Ho -Oh, oh, actually, the first set I or pack I ever opened was this. Oh, Tapu League GX, that's huge! Wow, that's a huge pull right there. That's a huge pull. And Flying Pikachu V! Yeah! Oh, two huge pulls on that one. Wicked! Oh, I love that. All right, moving into our second second one. I don't know, that first one was great. That was uh, at least two that I didn't have already. So, pretty thrilled about that. Let's go ahead, once again. Remove that, and as we flip, we can see. All right, Eveltai, Evelt, Veltai, Veltau, Yelp, Yeltau. It's a good thing no one's grading me on my my pronunciation. We got Zekrom, Lugia. And a Surfing Pikachu VMAX. Wicked card. Actually a wicked cool card. Alright, two sets left to go. Two, uh, two packs left to go. I have a good feeling about this one. Let's just jump into it. Let's just go for it. No reason to doubt yourself. Here we go, one more time. That goes over there. And we get ready, we flip it over, and we start things off with uh, Reshiram. Palkia, nice. Cosmoem. And a Sogaleo. Alright, that's a neat one. It's another new one for my set as well. My own personal collection that I'm building up here. Sleeve, sleeve, sleeve. Sleeve, sleeve, sleeve. I know that I love to sleeve. 
It actually does feel pretty good to put cards in sleeves. I don't know why. It's just part of the process. All right. Our last pack. Our last chance for a uh, holographic Charizard, Blastoise, Venusaur. Any of them, please. Please. And let's see as we open it up. Here we go, guys. We're hoping for luck. We're hoping for some luck. And here we go. Flip it over and here we go. Dialga. Okay, another one I haven't gotten yet. Xerneas. Cosmog. And our very last card is a Pikachu Full Art. That is a, just a great card. That is just a fantastic card. I love it. Hey guys, thanks for sticking around. Uh, I think we had some pretty good pulls. A little disappointing still that the, the V Union card situation, but I'm sure I can pick that card up somehow, somewhere. It shouldn't be too, too bad. Uh, as always, make sure you hammer that like button, subscribe, ring the notification bell, all the things you hear the YouTubers say because it really does help the channel grow. Thanks so much for hanging out and I'll see you in the next card unboxing.